So guys, welcome to the Darian and Darian channel and like the previously we started our new series about the Python and in the today's Python video I am telling you about the while loops. This is very important video for that audience who are mastering the Python so uh, for that that this video is very important. So see the video start to end and in today's video we are learning, learning about the while loops and what what is while loops what is that in today's video your whole concept will be clear about it if you see the video start to end okay so now i do i do not take a long time so let's move to computer screen and let's learn about what are while loops in the pattern so let's move to computer screen and let's do a coding with laughing so guys in today's pattern video i'm telling about the while loops in pattern if you don't know what are while loops in the pattern so your whole concept will be clear about it so uh, when uh, without wasting the time, let's get started and let's learn about what are lo while loops in Python and this chapter are very important if you are mastering in the Python so must must know what are while loops okay so let's get started Python loops Python has two primitive loop commands what two primitive loop commands what while loop and for loops if you don't know what is while loop and for loop so in the uh, in this video i told you about the while loops so in the previous in the next video i told you about the for loops okay so do not take a stress the while loop with the while loop we can execute a set of statement as long as condition is true example in the example we print i as long as i is less than 6 let me copy that and let me open one new window and in this new window I make one file by the name of dick.py when I make this file on my document and when I create file so it say hey uh, dick.py uh, dick are already active do you want to replace it means like this file is already made it with this name so what you want to replace it if then in that file it any important work so then you can press no if there is no important work so you can press yes so in in my dat file there is not any important work so i press yes and i paste this code here so when i save it and run it so it give me like one two three four five why let me tell you because of first of all i write like i equals to one i say a start it uh, start the number with one and in the second line of code i wrote here while loop and using the while loop i write here in the space between here one white space and then here i write like i i variable then here i write like less than sign then six mean i say print the numbers till six so it will be printing me till six if i say start the number from zero so it give me zero one two three four five six here you can see it if i print here number 50 so it give me till 50 zero to fill 50 here you can see it it give me zero till 50 the numbers why because I write here my figures 50 so that's why if you write here 1000 so it will be printed due to 1000 numbers okay note that note that you can note uh, this okay, remember to increment i or less the loop will continue forever the while loop requires relevant variables to be ready in the example we need to define an indexing variable i which we set to 1 the break statement I make the detailed video about the break statement if you don't know what is break statement so I already told you about that what are break statement what are continuous statement with the break statement we can stop the loop even if the while loop is condition is true using the break statement when you if you write here thousand if you write thousand so it will be printed you forever but when you write here break statement then it will be stop exit the loop when i is 3 in the example we are exiting the loop when i is 3 save it and then it so here it is giving me only three but i write here my figure six why it is only giving me only three because of first of all i write like here i variable and in the i variable i write like equals to one then in the second line of code i write like while loop using the while loop i write here i variable then i write like less than six then in the third line of code i say do the python print the i then i write like if statement then using the if statement I write like I variable then I say equals to equals to 3 then I write like break statement that means I say do the python when my figure my condition is coming true in the number of 3 and then I write like break statement when I write here 100 when I write here 200 and when I say in the 10 my figure is coming true so it is only give me till 10 here you can see it why it is giving me only till 10 because here I write, here I write like 
before after the 10 my my condition is coming true so that's why and if i do not write a break statement and if i write like nothing here and save it and it should give me number till 200 here you can see it it give me one till 200 here you can see it now continue statement i have told you the break statement if you don't know what is continuous statement so let me tell you with the continuous statement we can stop the current iteration and continue with the next example continue to the next iteration if i is 3 when i copy this and when i i paste this from here save it and run it should give me till 1 2 4 5 6 why it is not giving me 3 because first of all in the fourth line of code i say to the python number 3 uh, after the number 3 i write here continue statement i say after the number 3 my uh, start the numbers so that's why if i say 10 and if i say 5 save it and then it should give me 1 2 3 4 then 6 7 8 9 10 why does not give me 5 because i say after the 10 so after the 5 you can continue the your numbers okay so that's why so the else statement with the else statement we can run a block of code once when the condition no longer is true example in the example we are printing a message once the condition is false in this example save it and then it should give me i is no longer less than six why because i is no longer than six is uh, it is giving me because of first of all in the first line of code i define my i variable and i variable i write like one then using the while loop i say i then less than six then here i write like print i variable then i write like i plus equals to one then i say else statement i is no longer less than six if i say here 50 54 so it give me nothing uh, it is giving me till 53 it is giving me numbers till 53 and now it is giving me i is no longer than 66 if i write it 10 and save it and then it should give me number till 10 it is saying i is no longer less than 6 here you can see it like that you can do it very easily yes so in today's video i told you about what are while loops in the python so i hope your concept will be clear about it this very main topic if you are starting the python or mastering the python uh, you must know the while loops if, because in the many job interviews this are uh, this question has been asked so that's why i'm telling you must know the while loops in the python so i hope you yeah, i hope you can enjoy this class if you enjoy so please hit the like button share your friends and subscribe to my channel and do not forget to all the notification bell also so you never miss our future latest videos so for today goodbye